Okay, we have a problem here I would like to describe in today's video. It's the it's about the Steinberg WaveLab Pro 10.50 and it's way how it handles um, multi-channel multi poly, poly wave files. And the reason why, why I'm screening this from my external camera is that the crashing behavior depends on the on the resolution of the screen and um, how I actually perform that operation. So please um, be um, be kind to the bad video quality and hang on. I reported this bug already in September, I guess, last year via version 10.40 or I think 10.40 was. I got the feedback it was solved in 10.50, but obviously not. I'll show you how it works, so it doesn't work. I take a two-channel wave file, here we are, and I can play it back. Here you have it, you see it's playing back. Take a three-channel uh, three wave file, do the same thing. It tells me it can't play all channels simultaneously. Okay for me, but at least it does play back something. Do the same with the floor. Surprise. Something playing. Excellent. My voice in German. Now I've clicked on the six channel wave file. Sorry, I wanted to click on the five channel wave file, but I clicked on the six channel wave file and it crashes. Splendid. So, even funnier, do the same on my primary screen. And you might already be wondering why I did a not a proper screen capture, but just a screen by my um, camera. Here we are. Opening it works. Playback successful. Excellent. Now to the th three channel wave file. Bam. Doesn't really work so well. One more try. And this time, go to the smaller screen. And again, open my three channel wave, wave file works and play it back something doing here excellent and now i will see oh you hear it it's playing back it works i will actually move it to my primary screen and now it crashes again okay maybe this is not related i don't know but this Definitely, it crashes on the on the larger screen and does not crash on the smaller screen. What kind of resolution I do have? I have a 4K resolution on my primary screen. I have a full HD resolution on my secondary screen, and I have a different scaling. So, what could one could think? One could think that it depends on the scaling. I try to set it to 150 percent done sort of yeah oh, i need a magnifier to actually see something on the screen give it another try here we are two channel working excellent three channel not so working. Okay, one more try. Display settings. Changing the resolution to full HD. Keep changes. Excellent. Done. Same resolution, same scale. Starting again. Opening it. Two channel working, working as expected. Three channel not working. This is really strange. Hmm? And guess what? If I only have a single screen, error uh, appears as well. I will disconnect it. Here we are. Going back to this setting, keep changes, 
150 empty project two channel working three channel working so what does it mean Something about the display setting? Yes. Something about the scaling? We don't know yet. I will give it a try. Or maybe if this. No. It's not really that much working. <laughs> Come on, more, one more shot here. Empty project. File browser. Two channel. Working. Three channel. Working. Not really working, hmm? Okay, maybe this happens on the other monitor as well. We don't know yet. File browser. Two channel. Oh no, first switch to the other monitor. I have to really maybe connect it first. So there we are. Second monitor, two channel working, three channel. Working. And here I can sort of make the program quit itself. Depending on the display resolution and the track number or the channel number, it crashes right away or it just crashes when I first do any UI interaction. Steinberg, if you're listening, maybe you want to think about improving that situation and um, maybe, maybe you can do something about that. Maybe not. I don't know. Thank you very much for listening and watching.